For the first time, the United States Army deployed the M142 High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, HIMARS, to the U.S. Southern Command's area of operations as part of the Southern Phoenix 24, SF-24, military exercise. This multinational training, held in Chile from August 27 to September 6, 2024, brought together over 600 troops from Chile, Argentina, and the United States to enhance hemispheric cooperation and increase interoperability for future multi-domain operations. The Steel Warriors of the 1st Battalion, 14th Field Artillery Regiment, 1-14 to FAR, based in Oklahoma, played a key role in the exercise, bringing the highly capable HIMARS system to Chile's Atacama Desert. Known for its mobility and precision, the HIMARS, developed by Lockheed Martin, is a versatile rocket system with a range of 70 to 84 kilometers when using guided multiple launch rocket system, GMLRS, rockets and up to 300 kilometers with the Army Tactical Missile System, ATACMS. This system has demonstrated its effectiveness in modern conflicts, including its use during the 2022 Russian invasion of Ukraine. The 1-14 FAR is an elite U.S. Army artillery unit, part of the 75th Field Artillery Brigade, and specializes in long-range, precision fire support. The battalion's nickname, Steel Warriors, reflects its mission of delivering highly accurate, powerful strikes in combat situations. The deployment of the HIMARS system to Chile underscored the U.S. military's commitment to modernizing regional security operations and deepening defense partnerships. Southern Phoenix 24 served as a platform for U.S., Chilean, and Argentine forces to engage in artillery training exercises aimed at improving coordination and strengthening military ties. U.S. soldiers from the 1-14 FAR worked closely with the Chilean Army, fostering camaraderie and exchanging tactical knowledge. Lt. Col. Anthony Allen, commander of the 1-14 FAR, highlighted the importance of the exercise, emphasizing the value of building trust and cooperation between the nations. He viewed the event as a critical step toward enhancing military interoperability for future joint missions in the region. The collaboration between U.S. and Chilean forces during SF-24 showcases not only the tactical importance of HIMARS but also the broader strategic goal of maintaining strong alliances in South America. As security challenges in the Western Hemisphere evolve, the ability to conduct joint operations with advanced weaponry like HIMARS strengthens regional defense readiness and enhances collective capabilities. The deployment of U.S. troops and technology to South America is part of a larger strategy by the U.S. to enhance regional security, support counter-narcotics operations, and build stronger military relationships with allied nations. This broader effort is coordinated by U.S. Southern Command, SOUTHCOM, which oversees military operations and partnerships in Central and South America and the Caribbean. SOUTHCOM's mission includes fostering defense cooperation, promoting stability, and addressing transnational threats such as organized crime and natural disasters. Joint military exercises like Southern Phoenix 24 are crucial to maintaining readiness for multi-domain operations and strengthening ties between U.S. forces and their South American counterparts. Through these exercises, the U.S. military helps to build the capacity of its partners while ensuring a rapid, coordinated response to shared security challenges. The United States and Chile share a robust and long-standing military partnership that has been strengthened over the decades through various defense agreements and joint initiatives. Chile is one of the U.S.'s most reliable defense allies in South America, and their collaboration is formalized through programs such as the Defense Cooperation Agreement. This agreement facilitates joint military training, education, and technology sharing between the two nations. Chile's military modernization efforts and its strategic location make it a key defense partner for the United States in South America. The State Partnership Program, SPP, which links the Texas National Guard with Chilean forces, is another example of how the U.S. continues to deepen ties with Chile. Through joint exercises like Southern Phoenix and Southern Star, both countries improve their ability to work together on complex multi-domain operations. This close defense relationship not only enhances the military capabilities of both nations but also promotes regional stability. It has also been crucial in international peacekeeping missions, where Chilean and U.S. forces have cooperated side by side. The Southern Phoenix 24 exercise, marked by the historic deployment of HIMARS to South America, reflects the increasing importance of military cooperation between the U.S. and its South American allies. The involvement of U.S. troops, Chilean, and Argentine forces in this exercise highlights the growing focus on hemispheric security and the need for interoperability in future multi-domain operations. As security challenges continue to evolve, partnerships like those between the United States and Chile remain vital to ensuring peace and stability across the region.